Kalamazoo is in mourning, looking for answers after six people were killed and two others injured in a shooting rampage on Saturday night. This is an opportunity that we get to pray for our victims. Authorities say the suspect, 45-year-old Jason Dalton, doesn't appear to be connected to any of the victims. These were very deliberate killings. Um, They were intentional, deliberate, and I I don't want to say casually done, coldly done is what I want to say. Neighbors who know the alleged shooter say they're in shock. He just seemed like a normal, normal guy. This is just so, so strange. We're wondering what might have caused him to do this. Dalton worked as an Uber driver. A passenger who rode in his car just before the shooting said he was acting strange. We were kind of driving through medians, driving through the lawn, speeding along, and then finally, once he came to a stop, I jumped out of the car and ran away. Shortly after that, authorities say the nearly seven-hour shooting spree started. 5.42 5.42 p.m., a woman is shot several times in a parking lot at an apartment complex. She survived but is in serious condition. At 10.08 p.m., Richard Smith and his 17-year-old son, Tyler, are shot and killed at a car dealership. And at 10.24 p.m., Dalton pulls into this parking lot at a Cracker Barrel where he allegedly kills four women in their cars, all over the age of 60. A 14-year-old girl was also shot but survived. Finally, after midnight, police locate Dalton's car. We determined that this was indeed our suspect. He was taken into custody. Investigators believe Dalton was looking to pick up passengers even after the final shooting. Uber said in a statement, we are horrified and heartbroken at the senseless violence. We have reached out to the police to help with their investigation in any way that we can.